Evening, everyone. It's uh, Sunday night, a little bit after six o'clock, and this is your weekly update on the gold. It's video number 358. And again, I remind you to please subscribe to the channel. It doesn't cost anything, and it makes me feel better. In any event, last week, um, I told you that because of the nine-week consolidation and then the little running consolidation that I felt that this week we could move the same as we did last week. Last week's move was 87 and a half and this past week's move was 88.40. So uh, we traded at a new all-time high for the December gold at 2005.4 and we closed at a new closing high at 1985.9. Um, I am somewhat concerned now because of the size of that move, although I don't really think that it affects our uh, position in Newmont in the spread, uh, which recovered over $3 on Friday alone. Uh, but my concern is because of the uh, US dollar, which as you know, I've been harping on now for weeks, actually a couple of months, that uh, we have been unable to rally consolidation, break to the downside, rally back up to the point of break, break again, and then the extension. But on Friday, uh, we actually bounced pretty well. The low for the day was about 92 and a half, and uh, the close was 93.32. So uh, that was a pretty decent bounce, and I think that we could easily test uh, the area around 95 to 96 before turning back down. Uh, but there is a study that says that once gold has broken by over 8% and has a snapback rally, we generally get uh, another move down between 13 and 18%. So uh, clearly coming off 104, uh, we broke well in excess of that uh, 8%. And now it looks to me like uh, we're going to have a little bit of a rally as we have uh, the gold. And I have a feeling that uh, we may get a little bit of a pullback in here. Um, I'm not as concerned about the Newmont spread that we have on uh, since it gained uh, almost $3 on Friday, and uh, I'm not concerned about that at all. Okay, everyone, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, and uh, have a good solid week, and I will talk to you tomorrow morning before the open.